Head play, Surgical Goblin, obviously at 65% in his season, in his career, I should say. So this is about as close as it gets. We talk about Surgical Goblin being the most decorated player in Clash Royale history. 18 individual awards, 22 team awards, basically owned 2017 in Clash Royale. He won almost everything you can win in that year, and here he is with a chance to get the big one, the World Championship. And how fitting for Surge to be the one to close everything out if he can take this game, and Nomisu looking to be the hero for China and WEDGM. Both players taking their time. First 30 seconds away, no one's blinked yet. I know that Serge just loves hearing that on the loudspeaker. <laughs> yeah, he just likes it. It's the bass. <laughs> it's the bass. <laughs> you know, keeping an eye on Nomis's face here, you gotta wonder if maybe these are making him just a little bit nervous. Yeah, and if I'm no Misu, you know what I do? I mute those emotes right now. Oh, yeah. Don't play Surge's game. Play your own like you did in game one. And drawing some cheers from the crowd. CRL number one. That's the dream. 45 seconds left in single elixir. Will we decide it all in just a quick 60? Yeah, I can't wait to see what this is going to be. Will it be in the sky? Will it be on the ground? You have to imagine we're going to see lava or golem from these guys. Got to dig the music. I really am, am enjoying myself, but I'm also very nervous. Here we go. Final 15 seconds of single elixir and tombstone to open up from No Misa. Probably going to the sky again. Wow. You've seen Ice was paired with Golem a handful of times, but now Surge going graveyard opposite. Wow! Immediate graveyard opposite lane. Baby Dragon turns to the offensive tanking Baby Dragon. Quite a bit getting through, but. Oh, yeah. 1300 damage down on the back end of that tower, and now Nomisa's turn to go on offense. Lava, Double Dragon, Miner against the most popular deck at the seeding tournament at the bottom of your screen here, played by Surge. King Tower activation with the NATO now out of cycle to deal with this, but will get support from that King Tower as well. Second Lava Hound down for Nomisa in the back. And you know what Surge is playing. This deck was played like seven times at the seeding tournament. You have to not send your Miner to the back. You gotta get it on top of that Ice Bridger. You gotta stop the defensive capability from your opponent. Graveyard and Poison spent nine elixir right hand lane. Does not get the tower down, takes care of those barbarians, but now has to deal with the Lava Hound, Baby Dragon, and a beautiful kite on that Inferno. Gonna need to pull this all together. There it is. And Bomb Tower does pick up. Miner goes to the outside, picked up by the Knight on the left Wait. hand side. I mean, King Tower. now that the, the, the King Tower is already activated, he doesn't need to go to the safe spot. And you, of course, get that support on the Inferno Dragon on the right-hand side. 9-11 still remains on the right for No Misa on the left-hand side, trying to find a way through. Tornado pulls it all together. 90 seconds separate Surgical Goblin and Team Liquid from the World Finals Championship. Graveyard down, Poison down, Barbarians in, trying to do something. Giving so much poison value time and time again. Surge is pouring it on. 70 seconds left. Here we go. Does he pull the trigger? Yes, he does. One more time. Graveyard on the tower. Defensive poison this time. 293. That's it. it. 